Cody Franzen playing the last year of his deal on defense, number four. And we're talking earlier that his name's come up, too. Yeah, with a lot of different teams, and he's an unrestricted free agent. Here's a steal by Lee. He cuts it. He squeezes one. Scores! Anders Lee muscled it through the pads of Jonathan Bernier at 1-11 of the first period. Off the turnover, and the Islanders lead it one to nothing. And Coach Horatuck was talking about getting off to a good start, having his team ready to play, and making sure they're playing with energy. Try to play a, a definitely an air-free game. Doesn't happen. There's the turnover. We're talking about friends, and well, that's not going to help him to get moved to another team. Good forehand move, just enough top spin on that puck, if you will, by Anders Lee. Look at him stretch, intercepts that pass. We've got some friends out there, no doubt about it, but. You always want a little revenge, and there'll always have a little sourness to your game when you play against the former team. Boychuk's big drive was turned aside by Bernier. But the coaching change, Riley, or Morgan Riley has been a much better player, a little more relaxed out there. Randy Carlisle can be very tough on young hockey players. Morgan Riley showing his offensive skills. There's Pollock firing, and Halak's got that. Any chance that you could do something that's along those lines? That's almost like we talked about a Vetskin last year. I mean, please, play a little defense. Here's Colin McDonald to the net, a save, made rebound, score! Sezikis was able to get to the rebound and beat the Leafs' defense to the puck, and the Islanders lead it two to nothing. Good strong move by Colin McDonald as he swoops in on Bernier. Bernier with no help at all, and that's been the fortune for the Toronto Maple Leaf goalies. You know, really, since for quite a while now, over the last 20 games or so, when they were playing oh so well. Colin McDonald picks up that nice pass to Matt Martin. Watch him drive towards net, gets the shot on net. Look at that, two Islanders beat the Maple Leafs back to the net. Both Martin and Sezikis were there to tap it in. And with the Leafs changing, Kessel waits to play it until Clarkson's back on the bench. Here's a lead for Polak. He fires, and that's blocker to side by Halak. And Karim's out of play. And there's another former Panther who's had all kinds of injury problems now with the Leafs. David Booth. Concussions most of his struggles. Sezikis onside with Martin. The pass to Martin. He's in. He shoots. Reimer, or at least uh, Bernier, the save. And if he didn't make it, we might have seen Reiner. Waver pickup from the Tampa Bay Lightning. Now Tavares ahead for Bailey. And that's steered away by Bernier. Good play by Josh Bailey. Just get the puck towards the net, force him to make a save. Letty fires, and the save made by Bernier. Hardy came back, though. I mean, that's that's what you need. You, you talk about leadership and accountability. And when your captain comes back, dart hard to pick up a loose puck. That's infectious. Lee with a shot. Snaps wide, came right back out in front. Finally, the whistle blows. Nelson in the center ice area to Kuhleman. He puts a move on Holzer, who gives him nothing. Kuhleman got it back. Waterbucks, quick shot, sticked aside by Bernier. For Nelson, now to Boychuk. His drive knocked aside in front. Not sure if that reached Bernier or not. Kuhleman looking for Nelson. Nelson looking for a goal. Sets up Boychuk, and that's blocked. Brock Nelson has now gone 15 games without a goal. It's the opposite of competing for a first or, you know, second pick overall. That's not going to happen this year. But there's not much coming, and there's not a whole lot there right now. And you wonder, as Grabowski's drive is stopped, whether or not in Toronto you can tear it down and just start all over. Exactly right. Well, he's not the general manager. He's the president, so right. he should have more time. Tavares. And now it's Lee for Tavares. Backhander from a deep angle. John's got it again. Turns every which way. And Lee. There's going to be a penalty here. I think Robida is going to go for holding Anders Lee. Delayed penalty. It will be on the Leafs. Boychuk's drive. Stop. Rebound. Lee goes wide. And as Robida takes possession, we get the whistle. Toronto PK unit is sixth in the league, so they're not terrible. Viznovsky for Tavares. Hard feed. Nielsen across. Save made by Bernier. That's a good save by Bernier. Nielsen ahead for Clutterbuck. Nielsen going to the net. Clutterbuck took a shot that went off the skate of Pollock. And back the other way comes Bozak. Van Riemsdyk going to the net. The pass to the trailer. Back to Bozak. Good save made by Halak. Kessel had been down on the third line at the start of play tonight. They were talking about him playing on the fourth line. Well, he was on the fourth line against the Rangers for a while. Still wound up minus four. 
Kessel with a shot. It got through, and it's held by Halak. These first couple of shifts. They win the faceoff. Robidoff plays it across. Now Panic. Got it right through the edge of the goal crease. Robidoff back to center. He is dumped by McDonald. Knocks McDonald down in retaliation. So McDonald gives Holzer a little shove. All of this while the Leafs handle the puck. Holzer missed the net. Rebound score. It was driven in by Richard Panic. And the Leafs have cut the Islander lead to 2-1. to one. Well, you can kind of see this coming, Howie, because the Leafs came out, had several good opportunities. Yeah, the referee missed a call on interference on Holzer, but the Islanders are really not moving their feet. It was the Maple Leafs that spent the first couple of minutes in the offensive zone. This is the, the rebound. This is the net. The big rebound comes off the right-hand side. Halak's trying to find it. And Bozak. Tries to clear out. He did. It went off of Letty's stick. And out of the box is Smith. The team's at full strength. Here's Panic. Two Leafs with him. Panic draws a man down. Put it in front. They score. It was an elevated pass. And it looked like it was knocked down out of the corner there by Trevor Smith. And the Leafs have tied the game 2-2. Two to two. Yeah. Toronto Maple Leafs find a way to kill a penalty for Smith. And Smith comes out of the penalty box. Howie just in time to find a way to score a goal. You can see that was a problem. Smith just got out of the box, takes Letty out, and now it's three on one. Boychuk does a pretty good thing, slides, and that puck is out of midair. And I'm not sure if Letty doesn't put it in his own net. Watch Letty as he's coming back, number two. Now that's that's Smith. It gets a good stick on it, good hand-eye coordination. Tavares, quick shot. Went off of Bernier. And ricochets to the corner. 12.20 to go in the period. Two to two score. Kessel, a marvelous one-on-one -on -one player, sets up Bozak, put it out in front, Van Riemsdyk batting away at it, but it's held, and there's no further play as Halak has it underneath him. Bailey was checked by Booth. 8.24 remaining in the period. 2-2 two to two the score. Smith gave it away. Tavares, a shot, save made. Rebound off the blocker of Bernier. And a hit by Polak on Lee. Play continues. Tavares feeds the blue line. Hamannick's drive, redirected, Bernier to save, rebound, score! Anders Lee has put the Islanders back on top, his second goal of the game, and it is 3-2 to two New York. And that's all about the hard work for all three of those guys down below the goal line. Bailey, Tavares, and Anders Lee, they just went to work down below the goal line, refused to, to be beaten. They won the battles and able to eventually get the puck back to the point. And again, watch the good hard work. Here's the shot from the point, Travis Hammock. But Anders Lee doesn't stand there and watch the play. He heads towards the front of the net and is able to pick up that rebound. Travis looking. There's a deflection from the slot area by Bailey. But Anders Lee comes from the right side. Look at him skate. Shakes loose. He's the hero maybe of the day. But it was the good hard work by all three guys down below the goal line. And that ties him with Philip Forsberg now yes. for the lead among rookies and gold scored this year. Got the Islanders three on three. Nielsen shot turned aside by Bernier. Van Riemsdyk joins in. Kessel to the near side. Van Riemsdyk worked over by Hamannick. Van Riemsdyk gets it again. To the blue line, Robidoux, his drive, missed the net, rebound, Kessel, and that's held by Yaroslav Holov. Wanted to play with Toronto, wanted to get into a hockey market. I'm not sure that he bargained for this kind of playing. <laughs> but Bailey put it in front, that's missed by Lee. Oh my goodness, he got a good stick on him, he got too much on him. <laughs> Here's Polak throw under the neck, clear to side by Holov. Well, they finally changed the rules so that they can get a more fair final. Here's Lee to the backhand for the hat trick. Denied by Bernier. And it drives one up high. Bernier <laughs> was knocked down somehow in that whole entanglement. And Polak went down like a bag of potatoes. Bailey now to Veras. Oh, and Bernier. I don't know if that shot was going wide or not, but Bernier still made a good save. Holzer's got it again. Looking for Smith, Halak out, he missed it, Smith looks to make a play, Halak out of position, and the puck driven wide, Halak to shove Viznovsky out of the way so he can get back in position. Jams it towards the corner, Strong came together with Franzen, and Cody Franzen leads Kessel, cuts to the net, shoots, Halak to save, left a rebound in the slot, and Hammond had covered it nicely.
Good play by Matt Martin, even though he wound up taking a pretty good wallop along the boards. Now, so many guys will try to deke that guy with no speed. Bailey a shot. And that, I think, went off the stick of Bernier and carries out of play. He gives him a shove. Here comes Riley to the backhand stick save made by Halak. Four Leafs trapped deep, and the Islanders look to attack. One man back. In comes Tavares. Leafs getting back now. Bailey to Tavares. He shoots save made. Tavares rescues the puck. Put it out in front. Nobody there. Leafs on it again with Gardner. Take Gardner to the red line. Lifts an easy one for Halak. He didn't get that out, though, so Ponick shoots one. And Halak the save. Ponick dumps Letty. Nielsen got a little, or Hamannick did anyway, a little pick there from Franz Nielsen. Strom for Nelson. Back to Strom and a save by Bernier. I think Travis, when he was a kid, wanted to be a forward. <laughs> <laughs> Since then, they've been pretty much in control of the game. Yes, the Maple Leafs have had their moments. Santorelli trying to provide one for Robidaud. Drops it back to Franzen. Sets up a screen. Shoots. Stopped in front. Sent out of the zone. Grabbed by Lee. Got Tavares at the far side, but the puck recovered. In the Toronto zone by Ponick. Not cleared. Hamannick breaks the stick. Islanders keep it. Bailey a drive. Save made by Bernier. Hickey jumped in. Van Riemsdyk got it back. James Van Riemsdyk sets up France into the blue line. He feeds Gardner. Down low Van Riemsdyk. That went off a lot stick. Nudged out of the zone by McDonald. Four seconds to go. Nelson towards the open net. Doesn't matter. Islanders win. And you're just hoping that the puck would have slid in for Brock Nelson.